Hi, in this video, I'm going to briefly show you how to use the delete row from Google Sheets step. It's pretty simple. I'm Alex Barlow, co-founder of Axiom. Let's dive in. So on screen, you can see that I already have an Axiom set up. It's going to read from column A, and it's just essentially loads of rows of links, which I'm going to the spot loops around, loops through, and then it scrapes some data and writes the results to a Google Sheet. Pretty simple. What I might want to use the delete step for is ensuring that if I've looped, if I've looped through it and read a page with a spot, or scraped a page rather, that I then delete the link from the sheet. So. So then basically I don't um, then run the bot again and accidentally scrape the same thing. So I'm just going to add a delete, delete row. Select the sheet that you want to delete the row from. It's pretty simple to set up. Specify a first row and the last row to delete and the sheet name obviously you wish to delete the data from and that's pretty much it now you may also want to refer to your first read step to decide which row to delete if you're using a, an axiom setup like this so you may want to if you're only um, looping through 50 rows you may just want to remove the last 50 rows of that sheet. So that's one example of how you could use the delete step. It's in fact what we call batching and is a really useful design pattern for building large scrapers or large processes in Axiom. I'm going to go more into that in a separate video. Thank you.